Microsoft has a great lineup of games coming up for its new console, the Xbox Series X. Here are 10 of the biggest and new Xbox Series X games that you should absolutely keep an eye out for. Halo Infinite 343 Industries debuted a new trailer for Halo Infinite along with roughly 9 minutes of campaign gameplay. The latter sees Master Chief and his new comrade in arms dealing with some anti-air cannons on the new Halo ring. Enemies like grunts make a return, and there's new dynamic life roaming around. There's even some warthog gameplay which showcases the large scale of the world. In terms of combat and vibe, it's certainly a Halo title even with the new abilities and weapons. Warhammer 40k Darktide Fat Shark are working on a new Warhammer game, and it will stick to its four-player co-op formula. Leo Hedge Wakelin, community manager at Fat Shark, stated, We'll still be delivering on that same brutal melee combat that's easy to pick up, yet layered with subtle mastery for those players who take on the hardest challenges the game has to offer. Dark Tide won't just be a melee romp, though, as we're going to bring ranged gameplay up to the same level as the melee we're known for to really offer players diverse choices and gameplay styles through a more hybrid combat experience. The game will be out in 2021. Stalker 2 We first heard of Stalker 2 a few years back, but since its surprisingly premature announcement, we haven't heard or seen much of the game. Until now, that is. Now we got our first proper look at the upcoming horror first-person shooter. The trailer looks suitably atmospheric and oppressive, showing plenty of spooky environments like an unwelcoming forest, overgrown parts of Chernobyl, decaying structures, and more, while also teasing the sort of horror fans of the Stalker games will demand and be very used to. There isn't a whole lot of gameplay in there, but after years of silence, fans of the Stalker series will be glad to see at least something. Forza Motorsport it was widely expected that the next game in the Forza Motorsport series would be announced soon. Interestingly enough, the next game in the racing series seems to be called simply Forza Motorsport, suggesting a new direction for the series, or a fresh start if nothing else. Either that, or this is just a tentative name. Xbox boss Phil Spencer also said before premiering the game's debut trailer that Turn 10 are leveraging the Xbox Series X's hardware to deliver what looks like a true technical showcase, as Forza games usually do. He also confirmed the game will run at 4K and 60 frames per second, while ray tracing will also be supported. State of Decay 3 Undead Lab's next title is what you'd expect it to be. It's State of Decay 3, and though no gameplay was seen, it did offer a tease and some new threats that players will face. These new threats are essentially zombie animals. An element of being hunted by other wildlife is also present, and it seems there will even be more survival elements as well. Either way, if the snow-covered landscape is anything to go by, there will be new settings to fight the undead in. State of Decay 3 will be coming to Xbox Series X and, if it follows the pattern of previous titles, PC as well. As Dusk Falls Microsoft's Xbox Series X will also have games that will be heavily based on storytelling. One such game is As Dusk Falls from Interior Night. Featuring an interactive story, As Dusk Falls will be the studio's debut game. As Dusk Falls is our studio's debut game. It is about two families whose trajectories collide in the Arizona desert in 1999. Most stories start at the beginning, but this story starts in the middle, gradually widening outward to encompass multiple points of view over a 30-year span. A story spiral that explores the past, present, and future of a single dramatic night, stated Caroline Marshall, founder and creative director at Interior Night. Hello Neighbor 2 Hello Neighbor was the kind of game that seemed to have such an interesting, exciting idea on paper, which unfortunately got completely fumbled in execution. It's an idea that does have potential, and that might, hopefully, be realized soon. With an open world setting and self-learning AI, Hello Neighbor 2, which is being developed by Eerie Guest instead of the first game's developer's Dynamic Pixels, is promising to be a much better realization of its intriguing stealth horror concept. The game's announcement trailer shows some interesting gameplay footage that definitely looks encouraging, showing stealth, hiding, a tense chase, and more. Balan Wonderworld It turns out that Sonic the Hedgehog and Knights into Dreams creator Yuji Naka and Noto Oshima are heading up this new project, which is called Balan Wonderworld. Balan Wonderworld concerns positive and negative emotions, with the journeys of 12 playable characters intersecting. 
Along with a variety of 3D environments to explore and boss fights to tackle, there will be 80 different costumes to don. These provide different powers and abilities, from flying to shooting ice. Exo Mecha Exo Mecha looks absolutely fantastic. A free-to-play online competitive first-person shooter, Exo Mecha will feature an AI-controlled dragon which is basically everyone's enemy. The developer stated that there will be three unique game modes. The first one will focus on large-scale team-based battles. The second one will be our specialized battle royale mode, and the final one will be a small-scale objective-based game mode. Furthermore, the game will support two graphical modes on Xbox Series X, a high-fidelity 4K mode and a 120fps mode with dynamic 4K resolution. Fable It's been a long time coming, with months upon months of rumors. But after several insiders confirmed it, Playground Games' next game was finally revealed and it is indeed a new Fable title. The new trailer features the same mix of fantasy and humor that fans expect. No other details were provided, save for teasing a large city in the background and a new beginning for the franchise. It will be coming to Xbox Series X and Windows 10 on PC, and of course, like many titles revealed thus far, it will be playable on Xbox Game Pass from day one. And that about does it for this video. If you enjoyed what you watched and want to see more from Gaming Bolt, you can always hit that subscribe button and turn on the bell icon next to it. That way you will never miss any of our videos.